Hey everybody, it's me, Andrew. Get out into nature and tune in for yourself. Resonate with the Earth's electromagnetic field via 432 Hz, the universal frequency. Balance out psychologically and emotionally and further strengthen your brain and your heart's coherence as well. Get a plant-based diet going for yourselves today and nurture yourself right back into life. We are literally herbivores in our nature. Further balance out your physical body's pH level and to get with alkalinity, then you can generate some static electricity. Send me some love telepathically, set attention to your mind and set intention to communicate. That is all there is to telepathy. You are now tuning in to great days. So uh, I'm going to talk on healthier states of consciousness this evening um, and and uh, developing more healthier states of consciousness okay, because this is a, this is very vital to one's um, to one's vitality and their personal uh, expansion of consciousness. So let's get right into this. Um, you want to you want to uh, come into healthier states of consciousness, right? Consciousness is awareness. So you want to be able to come into a healthier state of awareness through uh, whatever is uh, the most blissful for you to be doing, which also is going to be expanding your awareness, you know, or maybe uh, doing whatever it is that is blissful for you is going to allow you to come into healthier states of consciousness. It's very, very simple. Uh, when you follow up with misery, it pretty much puts you in lower states of consciousness and it uh, leads to unhealthy um, states, you know. But when you start following bliss, when you start following joy, and when you start following um, emotion more often, it allows you to it allows you to come into healthier states of consciousness, right? Uh, so so just allow yourself to get into flow, and from here you can uh, you can eventually develop a healthier state of consciousness. It's very very simple, okay. Uh, and once again, a healthier state of consciousness is needed for everybody who is trying to uh, evolve, you know, because we need to be in a healthier state of consciousness in order to evolve properly. Otherwise, it's going to be a, stag a stagnated evolution and it can even lead to strain. And in order to avoid that, you would just need to do what it is that is bringing you into, into bringing you into a healthier state of consciousness. And it's very, very clear when when you are in a healthier state of consciousness, you know this for a fact, uh, because everything is just so much more synchronous, you know, and affluent and joyful and blissful and bright. Uh, Whereas when you are in an unhealthy state of consciousness, it uh it can it can be very very imbalanced in how much you are unable to express yourself properly, you know, or, or not only about expression but how much you're able to be in that uh that health, you know, health is wealth and health is also being at one with the universe or wholly uh, in a balanced state. So when you are in a healthier state of consciousness, you are in a balanced state overall. When you are uh, unhealthy in a state of consciousness, you are uh, going to be very imbalanced, okay? And you want, to, you want to avoid being imbalanced because this is where disease is derived 
you know, so you should not, uh, you should not follow up with, with misery and all of the imbalancing things, uh, that can find their way into your life, but more so you got to navigate a little bit. You got to understand what is going to bring you joy and what is not bringing you joys. So then uh, you just go with what is bringing you joys, you know, and and eventually uh, you are going to become uh, healthier in your state of consciousness uh, and not just your consciousness, but all other uh, levels too that will follow. OK, it's a very, very simple message for this evening. We'll make it short, simple. Uh, I do thank everybody for watching. Peace out. One love and have a great evening.